The natural evolution for some organizations is they start out with a single internet connection that takes them everywhere. As they evolve and they push more traffic, they may realize that there are certain organizations with which they exchange more traffic than others. So if you've got network A is talking to network B, and you're both paying your internet provider to carry the traffic between A and B, it may be in both of your best interest from a security, a latency, and a cost perspective to exchange that traffic directly. There's a number of ways in which that can be done. The first would be private peering. When private peering is when organizations A and B decide they have enough traffic between them that they're just gonna put a cross connect between their two networks. And instead of relying on the internet for the connectivity between them, they'll depend on that cross connects. Our data centers are very rich ecosystems with a lot of customers that do exactly this and exchange traffic for either this model. As you think about this model scaling, it turns into a lot of cross connects and all the traffic for those networks may not merit an individual cross connect in the cost of an individual port. So we put in what we call an internet exchange point. An internet exchange point is basically, you have a couple hundred networks in a building, instead of everybody paying for 30, 40 cross connects to the network they talk to, one person operates a switch, we put it in the middle of the building, we all connect to that switch, and then we'll establish routing relationships across that switch, usually with BGP, and we'll exchange traffic across that switch. Instead of going to the internet, we'll use this dedicated path that someone runs in the middle of the building. And that's effectively what an internet exchange point is. At Iron Mountain Data Centers, we believe very deeply that internet exchange points are the backbone that the internet is built upon. We have partnered with a number of internet exchange operators and continue to grow that list. We've partnered with folks like Amsterdam Internet Exchange, DKIX, the German Internet Exchange, Links, the London Internet Exchange, as well as several other regional players. By partnering with some of the largest internet exchange point operators in the world, what we've effectively done is enriched our ecosystem. Not only do you get to take advantage of the carriers and networks that are in the Iron Mountain data centers, you get to extend that reach to everybody that is a member of that internet exchange point in a region. It basically allows us to take that ecosystem, that connectivity reach of an Iron Mountain cross-connect and extend it to all members of the internet exchange.